The sun is creeping up right now. It's clear over Carlsbad and in Poway. Other areas, though, we are dealing with some patchy marine layer clouds and a little bit of fog. Look at downtown in La Jolla, about a mile and a half to two miles of visibility. They're only about four in Kearney Mesa, so you may be running into some pockets of fog in your neighborhood as you're heading in to work this morning. And patchy fog is going to be possible the next couple of mornings. We've been talking about this all week. And the other thing we've been talking about all week is this heat. So all of this pink and orange, these are heat warnings and advisories for most of California and the Southwest. So we're not alone in this heat wave. And unfortunately, the hottest days, Tuesday and Wednesday, are going to coincide with the hottest days of the year because summer begins on Tuesday. Tuesday night, the summer solstice, 924 p.m., but it's going to be hot through our Father's Day even as this warm air filters in across the west and then kind of sits there for a long time. So it's really not how hot we're going to get for a lot of us. It's how long we're going to be so hot. So there you go. Summer, those orange and red uh, colors, those hot temperatures still sitting over our area. We should start to get some relief on Thursday potentially even better on Friday. But along the coast, this is where you have to go. Today actually could be the warmest day at our beaches. I am forecasting a couple of 80s out there, 70s for most of us though. Inland neighborhoods, we're going to be in the 90s through the extended Tuesday and Wednesday up to 93 degrees. Some areas like Ramona Alpine could be up to 97, maybe 98 degrees. The mountains are going to be definitely feeling the heat Tuesday and Wednesday, 97, 96 degrees. Then again, there's a heat advisory starting tomorrow for our mountains and starting today for our deserts. And you can see why we're above 110, close to 120 next week in the deserts.